Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel. Today, bringing you guys another squad builder. I do like some squad builders. And today, bringing you guys the best possible Republic of Ireland squad builder. Yes, now that I am a rich man, I can afford these big money squads. This squad includes the likes... Well, I'm not going to get into it. I mean, I'm going to get into it. Let's show you the squad. So, starting off, in goal, we do go for... Right, let me change this up. Nation... And down to Republic of Ireland. In goal, we do go for Kieran Westwood. We had the choice between him or Shea Given. You can see, Shea Given could fit in there. But I went for Kieran Westwood because he's got the better stats. And personally, out of the two players, I prefer Kieran Westwood. I've used him in FIFA before in career mode. He's a decent keeper, so we went for him. Out and right back, we have the man from Everton, Seamus Coleman, coming into the team. There he is, the best right back from Ireland. Then we go for two centre backs, which are Damien Delaney and uh, Kieran Clark. Sorry, guys, I have a bit of a cold at the moment, so I'm having to deal with that at the moment. You guys are going to have to deal with it for this video. Damien Delaney and Kieran Clark, and then at left back we do go for Ward, who used to play for Wolves, currently at Burnley now. Uh, Stephen Ward, who could also play up striker if you wanted to in career mode. I think he used to be able to. I don't know if he still can. I'm pretty sure he still can. To be honest, this defence. Is not a very good defense it's just not it lacks pace Delaney 48 Clark 65 Ward 67 Coleman 80 not too bad but really this defense isn't good um, but still it's not the worst to be honest but if you got likes of I don't know say Dumbia uh, other other quick players who just have gone out of my head or Bambi Yang because I was using this team in divisions um, they are going to just rip straight past you and it's not going to be pretty at all. So let's move on into the CDM. We have a player who I'm not too fond of. It is James McCarthy because he broke Dimitri Payet's ankle and now there's just a huge Twitter row between Everton fans and West Ham fans on Twitter. Obviously because it's a Twitter row, where else would, the, where else would it be going on? But yeah, James McCarthy, I'm not too fond of him to be honest. Um, we'll then go down to this CM. Uh, it is a CDM. You just saw him, uh, and he's not very great. It's Glenn Whelan. Uh, nothing really to say about him. Not the best player in the world, and he just gets into this team because he is 75 overall. Then this guy, the best player in the team, legend Roy Keane. Let's take a look at him. Medium height, uh, work rates, and a very good player. 90 physical and 81 passing. Let me tell you now. His through balls are incredible. They just they just put the exact amount of power you need on it, and he's actually really good. And if you're on uh, Xbox, um, then yeah, I'll definitely say try out Roy Keane if you've got the coins as one of your legends. I'd put him on the shortlist. Then moving on into the cam, we go for Wes Houlihan, uh, who is actually a really good player. Four star skill moves, high low work rates, and surprisingly, is a pretty much a hidden gem. If you're building BPL teams. And you don't know who to put in cam. Wes Houlihan isn't a bad shout. He's actually a pretty decent player. Moving on into the two strikers here. We go for Shane Long. And he is followed by the Irish legend Robbie Keane. Uh, two Keanes in the team. Roy Keane, Robbie Keane. And they're not related, are they? For some reason, I always think they're related. If they are, let me know. But I'm pretty sure they're not. But yeah, Shane Long and Robbie Keane are both really good strikers to be fair. Shane Long's picked up 4 and 7 and Robbie Keane has picked up 3 and 6. And Robbie Keane is a poacher's... It's, yeah, he's a brilliant poacher. And Shane Long uh, has got good pace as well, 8-6, because in form. And let's have a look at some of the other players who couldn't quite make the cut. Actually, I'll let you know. Glenn Whelan, I do normally take out and I've been playing with Harry Arter's hero card instead. Uh, I'm not quite sure why he got a hero card. If you know in the comments, please do let me know. That would be great. Um, greatly appreciated. But yeah, Harry Arter is who I normally stick in there. His hero card. We also get the likes of Jonathan Walters, Man of the Match card, and Daryl Murphy's striker card. There's other other players who we got who aren't quite making the first uh, starting 11, like Ada McGeady, of course, five star skillers. Um, Gibson, Ireland, O'Shea, Given, Whelan. These are just pretty much the next highest rate highest rated players um, McLean, Wilson, Grealish and then um, all the 72 raiders I picked Damian Duff because he is a bit of a legend isn't he of the Premier League so we stuck him in there but yeah this is normally the team I go for I do normally take Glenn Whelan out I have been trying most of the players I haven't got round to a few of them 
but I've been playing some of them. So you will be seeing them in the goals in the goal section. But this is the team, the best possible Republic of Ireland squad. If you guys want to see some more best possible teams, then make sure to let me know in the comments. Uh, I've been telling you quite a few things to do in the comments. If someone could actually answer all my questions, that would be great. I probably should have done my research before making this video. But nonetheless, if you guys like this team, do hit the thumbs up button. That would be greatly appreciated. Subscribe if you're new. And other than that, I'll see you guys in another video.